Um, hey guys, this is Dow Phoenix, and I wanted to get on here to address a particular problem viewer on my channel. I don't know who this person is specifically, but they managed to get an eBay listing I had for the 151 Nintendo cartridges pulled. Uh, even though there exists several eBay listings, as you can see here, both for the Famicom version of the cartridge as well as the American NES version of the cartridge. Uh, the prices for the Famicom start at just 5 bucks, which is because it's coming straight from China, uh, although the ones that are actually coming from America start at about $18. Uh, well, they started about $26, $27 and up for the uh, North American version of the cartridges, you know, the actual NES cartridge. Um, so I was trying to sell a cartridge in the same particular manner as these other people are. Uh, these, um, you know, bootleg NES cartridges that have a lot of uh, different games on there. Um, and so, anyways, this person apparently decided to report my eBay listing. Um, and so my eBay listing got pulled uh, from this as a result of this. Now, I still have two of these cartridges, and you can get in touch with me privately if you're interested in this. Um, given the circumstances, I'm not going to... Uh, charge, I mean, it basically sell them at cost, um, which I'll, you know, we could discuss that privately because I don't want somebody to rain on my parade over that, you know. But um, if you are interested in obtaining one of these cartridges, I have two of them that are like this uh, that are gray instead of red. Um, the exact same cartridge otherwise. Just get a hold of me privately and uh, we'll discuss the details on that. Um, but like I said, this particular person decided to rain on my parade. Um, like as I was like, like a lot of people are, I was just trying to basically resell them, you know, make a little bit of money because currently I am unemployed. I'm still looking for work now. Fortunately, I do have a good lead and hopefully that won't be a problem for much longer. Um, I still have plenty of other things for sale on my eBay shop. Uh, I will be temporarily suspending sales next week since I'm going to be on vacation, uh, which is already a planned thing, you know, obviously I'm not just taking a vacation arbitrarily, even though I'm employed, you know, I, this is already a planned thing because I'm going out of state to attend a friend's wedding. As a matter of fact, not just attend, I'm actually going to be in the wedding. Um, but I just wanted to get on here to call out this particular asshole uh, that decided to do this when there are still plenty of eBay listings and eBay, um, unfortunately they're being assholes, not, being able to fully uh, fulfill the policy that they, you know, you know, enact. You know, they are still allowing these particular cartridges to be on the site and only pull specific listings like mine that get reported to them. So I'm going to be kind of an asshole in return, and I'm going to report every single listing uh, that I can find to eBay. And I'm going to let them know, you guys, you know, since, you know, you pulled my listing, I, I wasn't aware that this was against your policy. Um, but I think it'd be only fair since you're pulling my listing against policy that you pull all these other listings too. And I do want to let you guys know, uh, don't buy these overinflated prices. You might see them for 30 to $50, sometimes even more in various places. Uh, do not buy them. From there, because you can get these cartridges off AliExpress for about thirteen to fifteen dollars, uh, depending on the vendor that you buy from there. And that's just all they're essentially doing is they're buying it from the AliExpress vendor and then trying to, um, you know, return a profit on that. Um, so since this particular person decided to shit on my parade, I'm gonna shit on all these guys' parades, um, and be vindicative. You know, I hope that you enjoy the fruits of your labor, uh, what you've done here. So um, I will still sell other more legitimate items, uh, as eBay might put it, on my eBay store. I don't think that there's any particular punishment, since it is a first offense or whatever, but, you know, I am going to be calling out this particular person here, uh, if you have any information as to the particular party that's done this, uh, feel free to contact me, uh, downphoenix at gmail.com. And, um, you know, I look forward to hearing any word that you have from this particular person. Um, but, yeah, um, since I can't have any fun out of it, I figure I'd let you guys in on a little secret. 
Do not buy this shit from eBay. Do not buy it from video game convention people or anything like that. Because they're overcharging. Uh, they're basically just reselling something that is manufactured in China and then shipped to the United States, usually within two to three weeks. Um, so, yeah. That's all I've got to say for that now. Um, you know, if you do want to help out the channel, don't forget to check out the eBay shop. You know, that's a really good good way to help out the channel. I've been actually getting quite a few sales, and I appreciate that. Uh, like I said, early next week, though, I will be suspending the items in the shop, so anything that's unsold, I'll just relist it once I come back from that vacation. And hopefully the uh, job lead works out, and I'll be able to go back to regular employment um, so that I can actually have a day job and, you know, do something like a normal person does instead of being an internet loser that tries to make money off Patreon or something like that and tries to beg people for money, um, you know, since uh, that's a very childish thing to do, essentially, you know, when it, especially when you're all you're doing is making YouTube videos that don't offer any real type of content. Like I can see someone doing a Patreon, like if they're a musician or something like that, for instance, or um, they're, you know, a person making short films, like actual films, you know, that kind of thing. Patreon's for that kind of stuff. Patreon is not for people that want to collect a few thousand dollars a month to live stream video games. When there's, you know, tens of thousands of other assholes out there on the internet, not literally assholes, like probably like about 90% of them are actually really nice people, I'm sure. Um, but, uh, you know, just any random person on the internet um can do this you know they're and these people don't exude any particular talent at all um but people still willingly fork over hundreds of dollars a month um to these people to basically sit on their ass and do live streams a couple times a week or some nonsense like that uh so don't be that kind of person don't don't give money to people like that you know i mean uh, if they off actually offer something of real worth or talent, sure, sure, go for it. But, um, yeah, otherwise, don't worry about that. As a matter of fact, let's go ahead and click on the video games section specifically. And, yeah, we have more listings. So I'm going to report every single listing we've got here um, to see if eBay will actually be, you know, consistent in their policy or if eBay is just being a bunch of assholes uh, about it. So... Um, that's all I've got to say for now. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to share this video if you enjoy the content and maybe, uh, you know who this potential person might, potential, I can't talk right, who this potential person might be and you want to make sure that they see this video. I'd appreciate it. Uh, but till then, Dow Phoenix out.